face paint. A scarecrow could have a lot of fun with that. <laughs> ah, what's this? Ah, yes, I'm I'm Spud the Dragon. <laughs> <laughs> Mrs. Percival won't mind if I borrow this, and I'll bring it back in time for the school play. This won't take long, Mrs. Potts. I'm afraid there's lots of old junk up there. You never know when something might come in handy. Don't forget! Only step on the wooden beams, Bob. If you step in between, your foot will go right through the ceiling. Okay, Wendy. Wow! Look at all this stuff. Hey, colorful streamers and old curtains. And what's this? A tambourine! Hey! <laughs> Aha! Here's Muck. This'll be fun. Hello there, Muck. I'm a magic dragon. M -m -m magic dragon? How do you know my name? I'm magic. Bleh. I know everything. Wow. Would you like me to grant you a wish? Uh, yes, please. Okay. Close your eyes. Wow. Now, what can I ask for? Uh, maybe I could be twice as big so I could move lots of dirt. <laughs> Uh, or I could have another pair of headlights, so I don't get scared in the dark. <laughs> oh, I know! I wish I had a great big pile of mud to play around in. Hello? Mr. Magic Dragon? I made my wish. <gasps> He's disappeared. He was really magic, but... Where's my wish? Maybe it's waiting for me back at the yard. Hi, everybody! Oh, hello, Muck! Oh. Oh. <laughs> what do you have in your face, Muck? What? What? Is it... Is it mud? No, you've got a cat face. Wow. I wonder if it has anything to do with the magic dragon. Oh. <gasps> <laughs> Whoa! This is really fun! Oh, honestly, Bob, you're noisier than Rolly. <laughs> oh, dear. Are you all right, Bob? Um, I'm fine, Mrs. Pods, but my leg seems to be stuck through your ceiling. Sorry. Can you fix it? Yes, we can. <sighs> <laughs> Lofty? Bob's had a little accident. Oh, is he all right? He's fine, but could you go back to the yard and bring some plasterboard, white paint, and a bag of plaster? Oh, okay, Wendy. Now, let's try and get your leg out. <clears throat> okay, Bob, I'm going to push your foot up on three. One, two, three. Whoa! <clears throat> Thanks, Wendy. That's okay, Bob. <laughs> Here comes Lofty. This will be fun. <laughs> I'm a scary, fire-breathing dragon! <laughs> With googly eyes! <laughs> Spot the dragon strikes again! Oh, Bob, Wendy, <laughs> a big fierce dragon really scared me. Oh, Lofty, there aren't any dragons around here. Oh, there are. I saw one. It had uh, googly eyes. Oh, now, come on. It's all right, Lofty. Calm down. Tell you what, I'll ride back to the yard with you to make sure that there are no dragons around. Oh, uh, uh, okay, Wendy. Look, Lofty, there aren't any dragons now. Oh, uh, no, there aren't, are there? Hi, everybody. Wendy, look. A magic dragon painted on my face. Oh, uh, I saw a dragon, too. Hmm, sounds to me like someone's being naughty. There, 
there you are, Mrs. Potts. Your attic's all insulated now. Oh, thanks, Bob. Thanks, Wendy. I'm sorry about all the mess we made. <clears throat> I mean, all the mess I made. <laughs> Bye, Mrs. Potts. <laughs> <laughs> It's a magic dragon! It's not a dragon at all. I know that voice. Uh-oh. <laughs> Come on, let's get him! Spud the dragon. Uh, I'm sorry, Wendy. I was just having some fun with Mrs. Percival's costume. I was going to take it back in time for the school play. But look at it, Spud. It's ruined. I think we better go and tell Mrs. Percival what happened. Oh, do we have to? Oh, no. I don't know if we can fix this in time for tonight. I'm really sorry, Mrs. Percival. Just a minute. I have an idea. Ta-da! One dragon costume. <gasps> it's fantastic, Wendy. You used Mrs. Potts' old junk. Well, she did say it might come in handy. It's Wendy the dragon now. <laughs> 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 Come back, Spud. It's only me. <laughs> <laughs>